Hey everyone, today we're here downtown Belfouche at Budget Appliance with the fine folks from the organization A Bed in Need. There's so many of you here and I love it and you all have something to contribute to this organization. So why don't you start off by telling me about how you saw this need in the community. We have an 11 year old girl named Abby who's going into the sixth grade and she would come home and she would say, Mom, I have some friends and other kids in our community that don't have a bed. So what we would do is Gary and I would find out who these people were and we would give them a bed. And that's the long and short of it. <laughs> well, one night, Gary and I thought, gosh, we should do this as a nonprofit. And that's where we went and spoke to Sherry. My dad's always been a very generous man. And so it's always something that I kind of grew up with. Um, just trying to help anybody you can. So yeah, we started discussing it and there's a big need. We have helped fire victims. We've helped grandparents that end up with emergency custody of grandchildren. We've helped foster families. Um, we've helped single parents. So it's pretty awesome what we get to do. We have an application that we have that they fill out and then we as a board meet and discuss it and we talk to the people and find out what the need is and go from there. We do a mattress, we do a, a lot of times like on the twins, we do a just a raised frame mm -hmm. and then they don't need the box spring. Right. We have done sets. I mean, it's just something so basic that you really don't think about people needing them. That's what really got to me is because I, have been very fortunate in my life with my parents and my family. So when you think about it, it's really kind of devastating. We've helped so many people and it's wonderful seeing their reaction and because a lot of them come and support us at bingo and stuff too. Things And we actually do a little bit more than just beds. Mm -hmm. If people need, you know, bedding or even clothes or dishes or things like that, we try to provide that for them. You'd be surprised at the number of people, number of kids that are in dire need just for a bed. It's a more expensive item and so we uh, try to provide that. Well, I think we've we've gone to Sturgis, we've gone to Spearfish. Mm -hmm. We did uh, one in Rapid City. One in Rapid, did one in Rapid oh, City. Okay. So we're kind of the Northern Hills. We're associated with Artemis House and we're associated with uh, South Dakota Kids Belong. I mean, there's kids sleeping on the floor in the winter time. And, uh, there's people sleeping on the floor. People sleeping on the floor. It isn't just the kids mm -hmm. and, and, uh, and not ideal conditions. So we want to help any way we can. And it's kind of heartwarming to see the people's appreciation because they do. They really, really do appreciate it. And uh, we're glad to do it. <laughs> 